Okay, continuing with our test on this inverter, we're going to do some centrifugal start motors and let's see how they work uh, with the inverter and how they work with normal power. Okay, plugging this into uh, regular AC power. Seems to be working pretty normally. Okay, amp draw is about 6.1. But let's plug that thing into the inverter and see what happens. Okay, here we are plugged in the inverter. I'll turn it on. I'm drawing about the same amps with this thing. But now here it's getting a little goofy. The amperage draw is going up and this thing's kind of freaking out. Is it the fault of the uh, inverter or is it just this motor's about to fail? So we'll try a couple other motors and see what happens. Now here I have a pretty much an old antique but it's a centrifugal start motor standard old stuff. I've got it hooked up I'm hooking it up to standard power. Okay. It's rated at 3.8 and it's running about 2.71. There, now there's no load on any of these things, so uh, let's see how this thing works when I hook it up to the inverter. Okay, hook to the inverter. Yeah, it's drawn pretty close to the same. But I'm not sure that that's, it's running right. I did have some jerks, kind of like I did with that other motor. Uh, now that's kind of interesting. It delayed start. Try this again. That took off that time. This one I'm not sure of. The motor seems to be working okay. I don't seem to have any problem with it. But one time when I started it, it hesitated to start. Uh, possible the centrifugal switch wasn't making, but I think it did. And uh, it did show some jerks. So I'm going to reserve judgment on that one for a bit. Next motor we're going to try here. This is a vacuum pump. It's a centrifugal start motor also. Let's see what happens when it tries to start. Obviously, there's going to be a problem. Okay, it's not starting. Let me get you some amp draw on this thing. Okay, obviously, this is not working. We're drawing 23 amps. It won't start. Again, just to double check, I'm going to hook us up to regular power. So, it appears that the centrifugal start motors have a problem with this type of power. Okay, and looking around, I come up with another centrifugal start motor here. It's a fan motor. Because it's centrifugal start, I'm going to give this a shot with this thing and see how it reacts. Now, there's, uh, I'm going to show it first using regular power. Obviously worked okay. Now I'm going to put it into the inverter and this thing is rated at 3.3 uh, amps. So we're going to try it with the inverter. Strict 
position that I put here, this thing is made to be wide open like this. With a little bit of restriction. It does come down to about the normal amp draw. Uh, it starts okay. That's a centrifugal start, and it does start okay. Okay, the next thing we're going to go into is I'm going to try a few PSC fan motors and we'll see what happens there.